Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about how you can create a calculated field within Tableau. So calculated fields are very important because generally you don't have uh, all the fields or all the calculations available which you can directly use in Tableau and then um, based on the scenario you need to create a calculated field uh, to, to satisfy that condition. So for example, uh, we have this order date by year and then we have shipping mode. What we want to know is basically the shipping variance, whether we shipped before the date or shipped after the date. So what? So this particular information, as you can see, what we have is days to ship actual, days to ship schedule, but we do not have anywhere uh, which says that uh, what is the variance. So what we can do is we can right click on this blank space and click here create calculated field and let's give it a name shipping variance and here let's start writing days to ship actual minus days to ship schedule so what it will give us that whether uh, we are shipping efficiently or not so for example how many days you have taken actually to ship the item and when you are subtracting the days to ship scheduled you are getting a positive or negative number if you are getting a positive number that means you have taken more days if you are getting a negative number that means you have taken less days so just to give you an idea that if days to ship actual was four five days and however the days to ship scheduled was uh, four days then you will get a positive number and vice versa you will get a negative number so with that let's click ok as this is just a sample so once we click ok uh, this will be available over here shipping variance and we can track it over here and right now it is taking a default as a sum and uh, which i think is not a right way because what we need to see is basically an average but not the sum in case of shipping variance so let's take an average and uh, we get uh, some positive or negative number and based on this you know we can identify which type of shipping mode is really working in an efficient way and uh, which one is is not in an efficient way so the idea i wanted to give you is how you can create a calculated field by just simply right clicking on blank space either here or it's not a condition that within measure you need to click at it otherwise you can down there uh, go to here and click on the create calculated field and it will show you the same window where you can or you need to enter the parameters also you can go into the analysis and have the option of creating or editing a calculated field so that's a quick idea about how you can create and edit uh, the calculated field and in com upcoming videos we will see more and more usage of calculated fields to drive really uh, deep down analytics from our data so thanks for watching this video and meet you in the new video with a new topic